Hi folks, this is James, the unofficial mayor of Cowboy Country, and we are here live at Lavelle Edwards Stadium. Um, I got here a little bit later than I planned to because I was watching the Texas versus Texas Tech game. I did discover something. The, even though these stands here are separate, let me try to get a better shot here. Um, they are connected. So you can walk across, so that's really good. That's really good. I cannot take a selfie stick into the stadium, so um, I will tell you that um, there might be a possibility of my fingers showing up in the screen, so if that happens, I apologize ahead of time. Oh, wait a minute. I got my microphone with me and I totally forgot. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do this side of the stadium I'm going to do this side of the stadium, and then I'll stop, and I'll put the microphone in. Oops. There's a lot of people. I'm going to have to try to get to a place that's less crowded. I'll be right back. I don't know if you can hear me or not, but I'm on a stage, literally on a stage. So, uh, obviously this side here is really cool. Love the, love the big sign there. That's Jim McMahon. I think that's I think that's Steve Young. Yeah, and they have another one over there of uh, Ty uh, Ty Detmer. So, but anyway, I'm gonna try to go around to the end zones. It's the Cougar uh, statue. Let's see. I haven't quite made my way around yet, but people love to take their picture there. There's so much blue here. The atmosphere here is amazing. I'm so glad these guys are joining the Big 12. Here's the one end zone. Obviously, that looks amazing. Okay, I have to. I love cars. So to see this blue BYU inspired Audi R8, that looks amazing. Of course, this is a lot like the close parking at Oklahoma State. <laughs> People that can afford to park here have really nice cars. <laughs> Range Rovers, another Range Rover. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. I know this is a sports channel, but I have to get this. You see what I see. These are those new electric cars. They have like a thousand horsepower. Oh wow, that that is a great shot right there. <laughs> Sponsored by New Skin. These are called the Lucid Airs. They're $150,000 cars, but they're so fast it'll melt your face. Okay. Well, that's cool. I have separate entrance for concession workers. Okay, but yeah, that scenery right there is gorgeous. Let me get to the other side of the stadium. You can see it's like a lot of stadiums. It's the side that's not facing the highway and it's not visible. There's not as much stuff going on. But those stairwells, see how they're in blue? That looks really good. I love how the, this plaza area is decorated in blue. Like even the, the, they have to block off an area. Those are all in blue. Oh, that's good. All oh, the smells. I wish you could smell through the, through the camera. All the wonderful smells I'm smelling. This is truly better than any, as far as food is concerned. I've seen so many food trucks out front, and oh, he's got a cougar tail. He's got two of them. That's funny. The workers here are wearing orange. <laughs> Usually the fans are wearing orange at Boone Pickens Stadium. So, All right. Let me swing this over here. I got some kind of tent or something set up for fans or something. I don't know what it is, but... 
It's sponsored by All Pro Capital. So apparently they have some kind of cool stuff for the kids. I can't see what it says on the door. Hospitality tent. Okay. But let me get to. Please notify one of our event staff. I'm not gonna walk all the way around because with your location and playing that to six nine zero five zero. We hope you enjoy the game. Go Cougs! Great. Shut up. Okay, I'm going to try to get the other end zone, and then I'm going to walk back that way because my ticket is for one section 135, and it's on this side. There's these really cool new apartments next to the stadium. I tell you what, if I was a student, I would love to live there. There's not really a whole lot going on on this end, end zone. I do like the, the amount of trees that they have. That really does help, and I love the fact that at least they did some effort to put some coloring, you know, blue there. It's that's one area where they're definitely better than Utah Stadium, but oh my gosh, look at that scenery. Anyway, let me get turned around. Okay, um, I'm going to go in. I'll do a separate video of my fan experience inside the stadium, but uh, Lavelle Edwards is impressive. I'm glad that they have a walkway that goes all the way around and connects all four sections of the stadium. Um, they got banners everywhere, and of course they have a good reason to celebrate their history because of Jim McMahon and Steve Young and Ty Detmer. And so they have some history, and this atmosphere here is just great. These fans are wonderful. They're good people. I, I'm so glad that BYU is joining the Big 12. Um, so anyway, um, I will try to get this posted tonight into tomorrow morning. Uh, unfortunately, I do have a f flight that leaves Salt Lake at 5.30 in the morning, so I'll definitely be sleeping on the plane. So thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you are new to the channel, please hit like and subscribe. We're trying to get to a thousand so I can, um, basically I'll use the, the money from the channel to pay for more trips like this. Um, and also I just, from the bottom of my heart, I wanna say thank you to everybody who's a member of Cowboy Country. Um, I will tell you this, uh, I haven't even been inside yet, but I will say beyond a shadow of a doubt, that when Oklahoma State plays BYU, I want to come to that game in Provo because this atmosphere is just fantastic and the foods, the smells, it's just amazing. So I'm off to get a cougar tail. You have a great day. Bye.